That's right, guys. I'm out here at Dobson Freedom Park in Fairborn. We've been carving and painting pumpkins all morning long, getting ready for pumpkin glow this weekend. Ashley's here with me once again, and this is a type of event that just can't go on without the volunteers that you have. Oh, you are correct. We have different schools, VOAG schools that are helping. We have different community members. We could not put on this event without the help of the community and different volunteers that come out and spend their time to help us carve. And one of those groups of folks that are out here volunteering with GV, GE Aviation, I have Christy here. Tell me how GE Aviation is involved with Pumpkin Glow and why it's so important to you guys. Um, we have a group of about 55 people coming out on Friday. Um, we love being out in the community and helping and just getting out and representing GE Aviation. And you guys do volunteering as part of your work. We do, yeah. We do um, so, so many hours um, in the community. We do several events. We, do, uh, we offer relief aid, and uh, we love getting out and helping. That's great. Again, this uh, Pumpkin Glow Prep Day, the carving and all the art going on, it's at Dobson Freedom Park out in Fairborn. It's open now, and it'll be open all the way until dark, even continuing after dark a little bit tonight. So if you want to get your pumpkin in the big event this Friday night, starting at 7 o'clock, they're going to do it again on Saturday night as well from 7 to 10. It should be a great event overall. Back to you guys.